grab some popcorn and get comfortable because this TV show is kicking in that secret closet door. <laughs> Nori. Hi. We need to catch up. We do. The new HBO miniseries based on the classic French film has arrived and I'm completely obsessed with it. I trusted Lori though. I, I, I opened up, I let her in. <laughs> but it was great. It was great, it was so great. Before I went toxic. During the prep for a press conference, Mira finds out that her former girlfriend, Lori, is now in a relationship with Herman, a big time Hollywood director. I'm just not used to getting dumped. I think you're overstating that a little bit. And for Herman? Oh, or... He's a good person. Oh, he's a good person? It's nice. Douche from L.A. What do you want to hear, that you're a better fuck than Herman? You know I'm a better fuck than Herman. In the first episode, we learn about Mira and Lori's relationship. Mira is hunted by her ex-lover, Lori, that used to be her personal assistant and now ex-girlfriend. You know what I did today? So you've been on a tour spree, correct? Mm hmm all the stores that you used to take me to. When I was doing the buying and you were schlepping the bags. It is hard to express what I felt watching those two characters together going head to head against each other. Yes. And now you have your revenge. My revenge is to feel like I have you wrapped around my little finger. You do. I know. The power dynamics in that relationship seems to be shifting. In one hand, a strong desire for each other and in the other, the mistress-servant's-power relationship. Sit back. Now open your legs. Not too much. Like this. Yeah. I like that very much. It tells the story of Mira, an American movie star disappointed by her career and her recent breakup. You weren't exactly faithful either. <sighs> Who said I was monogamous? And you never thought that might hurt me? Honestly, no, I didn't. The show is a quick and clever crafted meta investigation of today's cultural image and early cinema. And I'm completely in love with it. On top of that, it's queer as fuck. Do you want me back? I want you back. Please, say it again. Please, Lori, I want you back. God, you're sexy when you beg. Lori's level of control of Amira is a fascinated aspect of their relationship. It is clear to see that Amira remains in love with Lori. And this is, without a doubt, the most visible component of their story. <clears throat> and now do it like you used to do it for me. <laughs> Do. Mm. Wow. In the first episode, we learn about Mira and Lori's relationship. Who are you to judge me? I'm not judging you. If you want a more boring life. You mean a more boring hetero life? Like when you got off on being this glamorous Hollywood couple with Amon. Wait, wait. Yeah. If I remember correctly, I, I wasn't only... No. You were fucking me too in between errands I was running for you. I can see you have a better life, Herman. I do. The series is a good mix of comedy and satire that makes for a charming, sexy, and laugh out loud series. I like when they look at you. It's embarrassing. But you're turned on. I don't want the crew to see me like this. I know you and you're turned on. I don't know. Irma Verb is fascinating and unusual, beautiful and sexy. And a new episode is released every week on Mondays. Will I see you before you leave? Do you come to the Plaza de Ney? What would you say to them? 6.30ish. I know you'll be there. I hope you enjoyed today's video and thank you so much for watching. Fuck you, Lori. Not yet.